Oh, sends chills down the spine. Cicadas returning to the volunteer state. A few have already been spotted in Rutherford County. And guess what? Millions more are on the way. Let's go to meteorologist Shelby Mack joining us to explain what their life cycle is actually going to look like once we see them. Shelby. And Mark, a few cicadas have already been spotted emerging in Middle Tennessee. Some residents in Murfreesboro have seen the 13 year brood slowly coming out of the ground and millions more are on the way. The cicadas emerge for the adult emergence stage. Jason Oliver, a research professor at TSU, explains what these insects do once they crawl out. They'll come out of the ground, crawl up on an object, usually where they can find a secure place to emerge from the last nymphal exoskeleton and then they will begin to harden their wings and and spread those wings those will fly to tree canopies usually uh, males will begin to group in tree canopies and start coursing and producing that's the, going to be the loud noise that everybody's going to be hearing the loud noise is created by the male insects to attract the females. The females cut little slits in the tree branches to lay their eggs, and they can lay up to 60 eggs per notch in a branch. The eggs hatch anywhere from 15 days to a month, and they look like ants once they hatch. Then they'll start digging their way back into the ground to find a tree root to attach themselves to. Coming up on News 2 at 4, we'll talk about when the insects will be the loudest and when we can expect them to finally hit the road. Mark. Our cicada expert, Shelby, thank you.